All right, right now I'm just a little bit annoyed with uh, scientist Sam. Because he's basically declaring that uh, some questions are stupid to ask. And I always thought that there wasn't really such a thing as a stupid question. It's when you make assumptions that it's messed up. So, I prefaced what I was trying to say to him with, with basically this. Okay. If you don't take into consideration that someone might be Abrahamic religious, and it's someone that you don't know, you've never talked with before, and you start talking about horror films, and how most horror films, older than, you know, 10 or 15 years, will often use symbols that assume that the people watching are of an Abrahamic religion in order to make it scary. So, if you do that, does that mean that you're not taking into consideration that person's feelings or who they are as a person? Simply because you didn't really think that much about whether or not they might be religious? If you have a discussion about mental health, but you don't consider that the person that you're talking with might have a mental health problem themselves, does that mean that you're not caring about that person's feelings or who they are as a person? So now let's go to the actual question at hand. How is catcalling considered a horrible thing to do to someone and not caring about someone's feelings or who they are as a person? But coming up to someone and saying, you're hot, is. Or, you're beautiful, is. Now, one of those things, uh, as Sam kind of had brought up, uh, supposedly to be sarcastic, but uh, one of those things has a little bit more of a romance feeling to it, with the beautiful thing. But, uh, all of those things are a declaration of someone's beauty. None of those things are a threat unless someone somehow interprets someone acknowledging their beauty or their physicality to be a threat. And in order for someone to have that feeling like uh, someone mentioning their physicality is a threat would require a type of belief system. So it goes right into the thing of, uh, you know, talking about horror films and not considering that the person might be Christian. So how is catcalling not considering someone's feelings but coming up to them and saying that they're hot is? Now, if we want to really be blunt about things, um, telling someone that they're hot, to some degree, is like saying, I'd like to have sex with you. But that is not the same thing as saying, I am going to have sex with you or I'm going to fuck you, you know, that would be a threat. But saying, I'd like to, or I'd love to have sex with you, is clearly not the same thing. So, again, how is a cat call not considering who someone is or their feelings, but coming up to someone and telling them that they're hot is. This may make you angry that I'm asking this question. You may think I'm stupid because I'm asking the question, 
but to me it'd be more stupid for me to make assumptions. So I'm wanting to ask this question, and I'd very much like an answer. Thanks.